Hi, I'm Matt from MattGavender.com, and today we're going to show you how to do a comic style in Photoshop. First thing we're going to do is we're going to open up a new file. So you go right up here to File. I already have Photoshop, Photoshop open. So you go up to File and click New. We're going to just use the default Photoshop style or Photoshop size, and I'll type in Comic Style as the name. Just click OK. So this comes up here. I'm going to zoom in a little bit by hitting uh, Windows Plus here. We'll zoom in a tad so we can see what we're doing here. And uh, we're going to make the basic color, which is down here, the front color. We're just going to make that um, black. So you just click this thing and it switches it from black to zero, from black to white. So black is your main color here. And so we're going to make uh, click the ellipse tool. It's over here on the left. And I'm going to hold down the shift key to make a perfect circle, but we're not going to make a perfect circle. We're going to be doing the eyes first. So, so I made that, and then we're going to make another one. It's going to be a bigger circle. And then we're going to make the basic shape of the face. So I'm going to make use the ellipse tool, ellipse tool again, and we're going to make it kind of big here. So right now we have the top. Um, we have the layer that is going to be the, sh the shape of the face, and that's on the bottom. It's underneath the two eyes. And right now it's black, so you have to go over to the right here, and you see that it's black here. And you can double click on this, and that'll bring up colors. And then we're going to go in here, and we're going to make a sort of a, a tan color. We're going to make it a little bit oranger. And then click OK. And so that's that. And then we're going to make the, uh, the pupils of the eye, and we're going to make them white. So we're going to go back over here to the ellipse tool. And when we do that, we're going to make sure that this color down here in the left-hand corner is white. So we're going to click this arrow thing, and it'll bring up the white. And so then we're going to make the ellipse tool right in here. See, right now you can't see it because it's underneath the black. So we're going to move that back up to the top. And we're going to duplicate this for the other side. And so now by duplicating this, we have two of them here. And I can have the auto select button clicked so that I can move this over. This looks a little funky, but that's all right. We're going to add a nose here. And so I'm going to grab the polygonal lasso tool and we'll make a little nose. So I'll just click here. make a nice triangle. So now we need to make a new layer over here on the right. So make a new layer and then we'll fill it. So, well we don't need to fill it. We can just go over here to the paint bucket tool. Grab that and uh, and now that that's selected we'll just color it in. So you just click right inside that what you've already have selected. We're going to hit, we're going to go back up here to this and click off of it. So there's the nose. And now we just need a mouth. And so we'll use the polygon last tool again. And we'll make a kind of a, a smirky, smirky mouth here. So that's all selected. And we are in the same frame as the nose, so we'll just fill that in. So we'll go to the paint bucket tool over here on the left. And we'll go to the bottom left and see the color is on white right now. And we'll make this red. I'll make it a dark red. Fill that in back up here and cl click this and then you click the screen and it'll click off of it and so you have a basic comic style in Photoshop. This is Matt from MacAventor.com and that's how you do a comic style in Photoshop.